Hey everyone, Scott here from Simple Mechanic Advice. Today we are going to talk about why the coolant reservoir is overflowing after driving. Here is what causes it and how to fix it. Faulty radiator cap. The first thing you should check when your coolant reservoir is overflowing is the radiator cap. A loose or damaged cap may not keep the coolant where it needs to be. To diagnose a loose or damaged radiator cap, start by looking for cracks or a damaged rubber seal and check if the cap holds pressure to its rated specification using a cooling system pressure. After diagnosis, you should check your owner's manual and replace it with one that matches your vehicle's specification. Overfilled Coolant Reservoir One of the most common reasons why the coolant reservoir is overflowing is because you may feel the coolant reservoir past its limit. On the reservoir, there is a max fill level mark that you should always use as a guide. Moreover, when it's cold, there is an empty volume above the coolant fluid level. After starting the vehicle, the coolant fluid heats up and the empty volume gives room for its expansion. The temperature of the coolant rises as the engine warms up, causing it to overflow. The first step to fix this is to allow the engine to cool completely. Ensure the level of the coolant is at the min or cold line by removing any excess and run the engine to an operating temperature. Stuck Thermostat your coolant reservoir may overflow due to a stuck thermostat, which causes overheating. Monitor your engine's temperature to ensure that it does not rise quickly and feel the upper radiator hose to ensure it does not remain cool while the engine is hot. This helps in diagnosing a stuck thermostat. Depending on the temperature of the coolant, a thermostat, which is a small temperature-based valve, works by permitting or keeping out the coolant from flowing through it. The thermostat will open after the coolant has reached a temperature of 190 to 200 degrees Fahrenheit. The coolant won't be able to pass if your thermostat is stuck. You may consider replacing your thermostat with a new one by draining some coolant, removing the thermostat housing, and finally installing a new thermostat. Cracked or blocked head. The coolant may boil or have bubbles when the head is cracked or blocked, as gases can leak from the engine cylinders into the cooling system. This is a serious issue that, if left unchecked, can lead to overheating and potentially cause more severe engine damage, including a complete engine failure. One strategy for diagnosing a cracked or blocked head is to conduct a compression test to check whether one or more of the cylinders have lost their compression. The pressure in the cylinder can also be checked using a leak down tester. In such cases, it is crucial to replace the head gasket in more severe situations, the entire cylinder head. Consider visiting a professional mechanic for a full diagnosis and repair, as driving with this issue can further damage your engine. Thanks for watching.